for the sterilizing agent, see sodium metabisulfite. For the reducing agent, see sodium dithionite. Sodium dithionate Na2S206 is an important compound for inorganic chemistry. It is also known under names disodium dithionate, sodium hyposulfate, and sodium metabisulfate. The sulfur can be considered to be in its plus 5 oxidation state. It should not be confused with sodium dithionite, Na2S204, which is a very different compound, and is a powerful reducing agent with many uses in chemistry and biochemistry. Confusion between dithionate and dithionite is commonly encountered, even in manufacturers' catalogues. Preparation Sodium dithionate is produced by the oxidation of sodium bisulfite by manganese dioxide. 2 na 3 plus MnO2 Na2S206 plus MnO plus H2O Alternatively, it can be prepared by the oxidation of sodium sulfite by the silver cation. Na2SO3 plus 2 Ag plus plus SO minus 3 Na2S206 plus 2 Ag Another method is via oxidation of sodium thiosulfate with chlorine. 3Cl2 plus Na2S2035 H2O plus 6 NaOH Na2S206 plus 6 NaCl plus 8 H2O And another method to produce sodium dithionate is treating sodium thiosulfate with sodium hypochlorite solution. Structure The dithionate ion represents sulfur that is oxidized relative to elemental sulfur, but not totally oxidized. Sulfur can be reduced to sulfide or totally oxidized to sulfate, with numerous intermediate oxidation states in inorganic moieties, as well as organosulfur compounds. Example inorganic ions include sulfite and thiosulfate. Sodium dithionate crystallizes as orthorhombic crystals of a dihydrate. The water of crystallization is lost when heated to 90 degrees Celsius, and the structure becomes hexagonal. Large beautiful single crystals of has been grown and studied for pulse glazing purposes with great success by E. Haussul and Coles. Properties Sodium dithionate is a very stable compound which is not oxidized by permanganate, dichromate or bromine. It can be oxidized to sulfate under strongly oxidizing conditions. These include boiling for one hour with 5M sulfuric acid with an excess of potassium dichromate, or treating with an excess of hydrogen peroxide then boiling with concentrated hydrochloric acid. The Gibbs free energy change for the oxidation is about minus 300 kJ per mole. In addition, the anion is not a good reducing group. Therefore, it has been used to form single crystals of large cation complexes in high oxidation states without reduction of the metallic complex.